No matter what you into, no matter what you see When you look outside your window, brown grass or green grass the MVP of the first ever Oyster Bay Classic from the Saints, Michelle Andrea. Michelle, what's it feel like to be named the MVP today? Um, it, feels, it feels good, but I couldn't have done it with all of my, without all my teammates. It was a big team win. It wasn't just me. There's a lot of other girls who got gotten this award, too, so I feel lucky to have gotten it, but I'm, I'm not the only one who did a really good job today. It was a team effort. And like Coach always says, whenever the team wins, it seems like four or five different people have three or four goals. That was the case again today. Just talk about not only yourself, but some of your teammates really stepped up. Right. Um, Flo and Deej had a great game. Squire, Mike, always has a great game. You know, it's really important that our goals are just coming from one person in the end. That's going to be a huge threat to us later in the on season because no one's going to be able just to mark one girl. We have four, five, six girls that can score. Talk about the atmosphere, obviously a neutral site game, but down on Long Island there was a lot of young girls here for youth clinic as well. Uh, what was it like with the whole atmosphere and the trophy and all that went into that? Um, it was a great day to come out and play lacrosse. It's always fun to have the youth support, to have them look up to you and play for them. Maybe they see themselves on the field one day. All right, let's see that trophy. Let's see that trophy there. Congratulations. Here's Sienna head coach Andrea Duffy and coach the uh, first annual Oyster Bay Classic goes to the Saints. Your thoughts on the win? It was a great team win today. We definitely put it together for 60 minutes. Good atmosphere as well uh, with the whole town here, a lot of fans. I know it's not the trophy you want to be holding at the end of the year, but still a trophy and kind of going through all that, maybe a little precursor for your team for the end of the year? No, a precursor, yeah. I mean, we wanted to go out there today. We wanted to put everything together. We wanted to play our game for an entire 60 minutes and never, you know, never rest in our transition. And we were able to capitalize on our offense event today. Game got off to a bit of a slow start for both teams, but talk about where it picked up, especially early in the second half where you put the game away. Uh, second half, we just started moving the goalie. We were able to see the back of the net and we were able to score and definitely had a lot more assisted goals in the second half. Uh, Michelle Andreo, the MVP, your thoughts on her performance. Again, it was a really good team performance, but she stood out. She definitely stood out in the second half. She was all over the field. She did a great job with cause turnovers on the defensive end, part of our transition, and then she was able to capitalize on her offensive end. 